everybody, welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels TV. Today we have a brand new 2016 Worldwide P case. And uh, we want to give a shout out to our friends at the South Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware Hot Wheel Club. Uh, I want to thank them for sending me a shirt and a coffee mug. And they've got a really cool... Um, Club car also that was done by our friend Chris Walker. Uh, really, really nice piece. So let's get right to it. Um, we will at the end of the uh, end of the show. I will give you um, my email address. You can get a hold of me at mikezarnock at aol.com uh, for information. If you want us to uh, give you a shout out here on Hot Wheels TV, and uh, we'll go from there. So let's check out the brand new P case. See what's in here. The old trusty fishing knife. And there we go. There we go. What do we got? Yeah. The mad props in uh, white enamel. And I believe we had that in the in the last case. 69 Dodge Charger 500 in the Mopar color. I want to say that's probably a um, subline. And the Porsche Carrera GT in a very uh, looks like mustard yellow with uh, gold uh, MC5s on it. Very very nice. Ooh, look, we have the 2017 Acura NSX, and that is in a uh, candy red metallic, and it's got gray Y5s on it. We got three of them. One for me, one for a friend, and give one to kids that stop by. That's why I always say, you know, if you go in and have with a friend, you always end up Split in the case, do pretty good. The terrain storm, and that is in a nice blue enamel. And that's got the bead locks on it with a, and that's orange chrome. Yeah, orange chrome off road bead locks. And that looks very nice. Looks like you want to hop in there, go fast. And another Porsche. And the bullwhip, got that last time in the last case, and uh, was wondering about if the if we're going to have the casting marks like the last one did with the little holes in the rocker panel and the little holes in the in the rear. This one has the holes in the rocker panel and the holes in the rear, so I'll have to compare it to the other one that we got last time. We have ooh, the Hollinator. It's red with a blue plastic base, and uh, I think a nice red altered altered state would look really nice on that. And we have the McLaren P1 in uh, yellow, and one's a little bit darker than the other, mustard yellow, and that's got the gray ten spokes on it with a black plastic base. We have oh, we have the 65 Chevy Impala, the low rider uh, from the Hot Wheel Art Cars series. And that's got an R on it. It is uh, red enamel, chrome base, and it's got uh, oh, the multicolor chrome uh, rings on the rim. And it's a uh, PR5, all small PR5s, black PR5s on all four corners. And it looks uh, pretty nice. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The Chevy Silverado. And that is in a nice dark red enamel with a white plastic base and a multicolor, all large uh, OH5s on it. Very nice. 
Treasure hunt! Look at that! The repo duty treasure hunt. This is the treasure hunt for the P case. It is orange enamel with a chrome base and uh, PR5 with a chrome rim. And I like tow trucks. So whether it was a treasure hunt or not, it's staying with me. The Nitro Door Slammer. Dark candy blue. And it's got a white base. And it's got red chrome trap fives. 1973 BMW 3.0 CSL race car. Did they make the names any longer? You run out of space on the card. Black enamel, and uh, uh, the lights are the same as the tinted window. It's a blue tinted window. So it's got uh, blue tinted headlights, very nice. It's got MC5s with a chrome rim, all small MC5s on all four corners. And another BMW. This is the BMW 2002. It's white enamel and it's got MC5s with a red chrome rim. And it's got um, really light pale blue tampos. Dark, light blue, dark blue, and silver tampo on the side. And, uh, looks pretty good. Here we have the 2010 Camaro SS. And that is the HWPD, Hot Wheel Police Department. Uh, you know, the guys from the, uh, the South Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware Club, uh, always, people always tell them, you know, it looks like a SJ Police Department. Whenever you got PD after anything, they always wonder if it's the Police Department. But uh, this one is Hot Wheel Police Department. And it's a really nice candy, dark candy blue. And it's got PR5s with uh, an orange chrome rim. And uh, I see a little bit of a variation in the color in the side. The top one looks a little orange, the bottom one looks a little brown. You know how that the colors get, they get dirty, and uh, yeah, definitely, you can see it, so that's pretty nice, and it's got the gray push bar, gray plastic bush push bar, which is the same as the interior, with a red tinted window, ooh, 73 Pontiac Firebird in white enamel, with uh, light green and dark green tampos on it. Black MC5s with a green chrome rim. And that looks really nice. Corvette C7.R. R's definitely uh, stands for race. And this one's definitely done up in Hot Wheels race team colors. Black PR5s with a red chrome ring. And uh, very nice very nice go ahead hop in that and have some fun oh you mustang guys try to catch me aha speaking of mustangs there we go we got the uh, ford shelby gt 350r in red enamel and it's got uh, gray 10 spokes on all four corners nice black red and silver stripes on the hood very nice Nice looking Mustang. Got two of them, by the way. And the Scorpedo. Little Scorpion. And that is gray plastic with a black enamel painted metal base. It's got yellow tires and the wheels are uh, OH5s. A gray enamel. Kind of an industrial gray. And that looks pretty nifty. And the Double Demon, you know, it would be so cool to come out with a, a five-pack like they used to with all the, all the monster cars, you know. Uh, always like that. This is from the Dino Riders. It is a kind of a pearl, dark red pearl plastic body with a metal teal base on it. It's got uh, gray tires, all small gray tires with gold chrome. OH5s. Another Scorpedo. 
And the pedal driver. That is black enamel. It's got uh, five spokes on it. Tan steering wheel. Mint tampo on the side. And a chrome base. I always love this little car. Pretty nifty. Pretty nifty. Ooh, the shark bite in uh, orange enamel. And a black plastic base. It's got transparent light green, maybe teal tires on it with a uh, light green chrome five spoke. See, now that would be really cool. You have the you have a little five pack going there, you know? That'd be nice. And speaking of more monsters, we have the Night Dragon. And that is in a dark blue pearl plastic body with a metal base and uh, light blue OH5s, a yellow uh, rim. See, now look at that. We can have all of these just like that, done up in a, in a five pack. And the Ice Shredder in red enamel. It's got uh, blue pearl drivers, two guys, three guys in there with a uh, black enamel metal base. What else we got in there? Ooh, we have the chill mill in a really nice pink pearl, the yellow base, and uh, black OH5 with an orange chrome rim. And uh, looks like the engine is black tint chrome too. So keep your eyes out. See if the uh, engine goes uh, black chrome to uh, to the regular clear chrome. The Quick and Sick, and that is a dark candy blue, and it's got the very dark maroon plastic base on it with uh, PR5s and a white ring rim on it. And uh, you know, I, I was wondering if this was going to, if the base color was going to change from beginning uh, to the end of the run. I haven't seen anything change yet, so. like this. This little 67 Austin minivan done in yellow enamel. It's got uh, all small wheel MC5s with a, with a chrome rim on it and uh, says Camels on the side which is Fraser Camel, one of the Hot Wheels designers. This is a nice, nice cool little car. I mean I like the little Austins anyway. They've made for some really, really cool drag cars. So we have two of them. So keep your eyes out or open. The Epic Fast in uh, candy lime, white plastic base, and of course the two different two different wheels. It's got uh, all black OH5s on the back with a purple chrome rim, and the fronts are small PR5. The Speed Dozer in orange enamel with uh, some mustard and orange and black tampos. Got a black plastic base. There you have it. The Formula Flashback. And that, of course, is in the Hot Wheels Race Team colors. Dark candy blue with red um, five spokes. And a very dark gray base, plastic base, kind of a, a blue gray, very blue gray plastic base. The Hot Wheels High School Bus, school bus in a dark gold chrome, all small wheel, five spokes on it. No, 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 that's not. It's larger in the back. Not that much size difference though with a flat black painted metal base and gray, dark gray grill in the front and exhaust. Looks like a rocket afterburners or something, whatever they call those in the back, turbines and uh, interior. A very dark smoke windows too. Pretty cool. The Velocita for the Hot Wheels games series 
It is black enamel. It's got some kind of dark yellow, pale yellow campos on the on the hood with uh, looks like olive. We have to check this compared to the one we got in the last case because I really think there's going to be a difference between these. Uh, there's a bright yellow tampo on the side, and the olive is is very faint. Uh, we're gonna have to definitely check that out. And it's got uh, green tinted windows with a yellow plastic base and green chrome PR5s. So we're gonna set this aside. Definitely check that out. The Amazon. Look at that in a light green plastic body with a dark yellow painted metal base. It's got uh, dark, very dark blue tinted windows. Yellow and black tampos on the hood and the sides and it comes with uh, chrome PR5s. It's pretty neat. And that is the 2016 Hot Wheels Games series. Look at that, Tour de Fast. And that, man, I don't know what that is. Looks like kind of a, uh, I don't know. Well, it's got a bicycle on the top. It's got uh, dark yellow plastic base. It's done in red enamel. It's got all large wheel trap fives, uh, yellow trap fives on it. And uh, the bicycle hanging out the back. Looks a little bit like a Citroen that my dad used to have. But the back looks a little bit like a, like an XKE Jaguar. I don't know. I guess we're gonna have to look into this and see who designed this one and uh, and see what their what their thoughts were when they when they were just doing this one. So I like that. That's pretty neat. And another of the Hot Wheel Games series. This is the Scupa de Fuego, and uh, we got two of them. It is in. Uh, Ready now. Got black plastic base. It's got black PR5s with a yellow rim and uh, black and yellow tampos. Kind of a tinted window, yellow interior. Very nice. Oh, we got the tool again back. Love the tool again. And that is in the Hot Wheels. Tool in one series. Man, I can't wait to see what these are going to be. It is chrome. It's got a uh, dark gray metal base and uh, red canopy, black OH5s with a red chrome rim. This is a handy dandy little tool. It's 3 8 for us American guys. And there's also a hole in the bottom. And that might be uh, somewhere around 5 16 or uh, 7 millimeter, 8 millimeter. So I'll have to see what that fits. Pretty neat. The 1985 Honda CRX. And this is a cool little car. It's in red. Uh, got red chrome PR5s on it. Uh, it's got a red interior, red plastic interior. They both look the same, so keep your eyes out for a change in that, maybe. A tinted window, and it is in white enamel. Cool little car. They are, they are very, very popular with, uh, with kids in my town, I'll tell you that right now. Uh, little CRXs are hard to find. All right, another of the Corvette. C7R, another of the Scorpedo, and the Roadster. This is a Hot Wheels game series, and that is in a mustard yellow painted metal body with a black plastic base. It's got black MC5s with a red chrome rim on it and uh, black interior with a uh, dark red tinted window or windshield. Pretty cool. I like it. Another of the mad props. We have the Lamborghini 
Hurricane, Hurricane, I don't know. Uh, LP 260 2 Super Trofeo. Like I said, man, we got we got names that long. We're going to have to start putting the names on the back of the card. And this is in a charcoal metallic with a black plastic base. It's got all small wheel gray 10 spokes on it. It's from the Night Burners series. And um, it is pretty, pretty nice. We got two of them. The 2017 Ford GT, and that is in a dark blue metallic, and um, it's got gray PR5s on it with painted headlights and a dark gray, the blue-gray plastic base, very smoked window. Blade Raider, that is, I, I really... I like this. I like to hop in that and just, just go tear up some sand dunes, you know? That's it. That's pretty wild. And that's from the Hot Wheels game series. And it's done in uh, in white. I'm going to say it's white pearl. Hard to tell uh, with this one. Got a black plastic base. It's got the red chrome bead locks on it, off-road bead locks, red tinted window. We have the Bone Shaker in uh, kind of a candy, candy olive. Got gray enamel PR5s on it. And chrome engine, black plastic base, and chrome interior. Ooh, we got the custom Ford Bronco back. And that is in a nice light blue enamel. Got some flames on it. It's got the uh, OR6 wheels on it with a chrome rim, black interior. It's like a gray plastic roll bar and roof on it, chrome base, and uh, very, very nice. You get together in the other one there, and the Blade Raider, that's some fun. We have the Futurismo, and that is a new casting. And that is done in a uh, dark candy blue metallic. And it's got uh, light blue tinted windows. And it's got uh, red chrome trap fives on it. With a greenish yellow plastic base on it. You be the judge of that. Uh, I'm, I'm running, out of, running out of names for these colors that keep coming up, you know. And uh, very nice. It's got, got a metal, metal center insert. Like the front bumper is metal. The uh, rocker panel. And the, and the rear bumper, uh, of course, like I said, it's a you know, middle metal insert. And, uh, pretty neat. Feels kind of heavy. I think it, this thing do pretty good for track. And last but not least, we have the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. And uh, we got three of them. Can't imagine what three real ones it would cost. Wow. Ready, Neville? It's got um, Wi-Fi's. Very, very nice. There you go. We got three of them. So that's it for our uh, P case, our worldwide P case. We want to thank the guys at ANJToys.com for sending it to us like they always do. Those guys are great. So if you're looking to buy cases, check them out. They've got other stuff too. Please subscribe and tell your friends so we can keep doing this. Uh, we're working on other videos, other things. I know you've been asking us for things, uh, but man, things get crazy out here, whether uh, traveling, going to different shows, to meet you guys, and um, you know, I, I love all that, plus uh, everything else that we got going on. So um, bear with me, you know, we get very, very busy. I get to, uh, I get to sleep like four hours a day, so I'm doing pretty good with four hours now. And uh, so we're doing what we can. So please keep coming around. Keep watching Hot Wheels TV. And we thank you very much. Keep buying our books. If you want us to give you a shout out here on Hot Wheels TV. And you might want to send us a coffee cup or your club car or t-shirt. Uh, give me an email at MikeZarnock at AOL.com. That's M-I-K-E-Z-A-R-N-O-C-K at AOL.com. 
and we'll give you the information for uh, whatever you want to send and uh, we'll feature it here on Outwheels TV. So until then, thanks a lot and uh, please tell your friends. We'll see you later.